Hey, you guys. Oh, yeah. This is going to be fun. I'm here at the Project Show, kicking it live and direct, man, at the Evisu booth, kicking it with my man, Nick. Nick, you got to tell me the story, man. This is unbelievable. I'm really excited, and so are our viewers, to be sitting here with you, interviewing you. What's going on, man? How you doing? Well, we've just kind of taken over direct distribution in the U.S., so we get to tell the Japanese story for the first time directly to the U.S. market, and we're just pleased to be here, you know, so. What's the inspiration, and what, what drives you? Well, the, the, the kind of story that's really not been told for real in the U.S. is that we're a Japanese brand from 91, started in a garage where we were hand-painting jeans. Yamani Hideoka started the brand back then, now have 65 stores in Japan, 15 mm. internationally. For the first time, we're bringing that story to the U.S. we just uh, done our first corner um, on La Brea with American Rag in L.A. We've, we've just signed for a store on Green Street. Uh, three and a half thousand square feet, which is going to be pretty crazy with a Japanese cinema in uh, Soho in New York, and quickly follow that up with um, Miami and Atlanta and Vegas. Talk to me about the uh, the collaboration you did with Puma. Puma, Puma for us is a, an important partner. So, Evisu is a very niche connoisseur-like brand, um, and we were getting a lot of uh, tough time from being counterfeited. Um, and we saw Puma as, a, as a, a great brand that we wanted to work with to do kind of reach a worldwide audience for a more mainstream product. It's not a handcrafted heavy suit product that we sell in the main line. But we thought Puma were a great partner to kind of put it out on the streets around the world. You seem to have a lot of passion. And you said earlier that you were at the, uh, the uh, New York Fashion Week. And this was the first time you were there. Tell us a little bit about that experience and the uh, results from it. Yeah, we, we saw that it was important to um, tell the whole story of Evisu in the US for the first time. So we started with LA Fashion Week last season, as well as we've done Milan for the last six years. And on Friday, we, we were invited as the first denim brand to go into the tents with a whole collection by AMG. We had 400 people kind of packed to the rafters. We had the greatest party in the city on Friday night. Um, and, and it's we're privileged, really, that we've got so many fans who know the brand from Japan and around the world that are really encouraging kind of the story being told in the U.S. for the first time. Nick, you're absolutely blowing my mind because, you know, one of the things I've always wanted to see was denim on the runway, uh, you know, especially in the echelon, you know, with the couture companies, you know, and you're doing it, man. You, you're, you're doing it. You're setting a stage for a lot of companies and, and a whole industry out there. Don't you think so? Yeah, for sure. I mean, for, we're very proud that as well as the more commercial line that we have to have hand-dyed bespoke products from Japan, which is kind of setting the standard for luxury denim products. Um, some of the indigo masters in Japan where they ferment indigo like back in the 1700s want to work with Evisu and, and we're pleased to kind of offer those kind of limited edition products to the few that want that kind of product. So we're very passionate about limited edition products. So we, when we sell out of things, we feel proud that there's only a few of those products around. Um, we're not a mass market brand. We're not chasing volume. We, we want beautiful products. And one of the things about beautiful products is that you can only get a certain amount of that product so that when our customers buy Evisu, they know that not everyone's gonna have that same product. So our most beautiful uh, limited edition products at the moment are made from fermented indigo. They're hand dyed by a Japanese indigo master. They come in a beautiful uh, black lacquered box, um, and it's special. It sounds like it's a science and it's a process, man, that comes from a whole lot of passion. Yeah, of course, it's from the heart, you know. I mean, in this business, you're either about heart or you're about money, and we're about heart. Once again, this is your boy AJ Jackson kicking it here live with Nick Man over here at the Visu booth. Project, having an awesome time. <laughs>